when I was diagnosed with cancer, I, I thought it was a death sentence. I was diagnosed with stage four rectal cancer that had metastasized to my lungs, both lungs. I was in shock. I didn't know what to think, what to do. I don't know if you've ever had, or like in a movie where they say that your life flashes before you, and that's what happened. And then when I finally wrapped my head around it, I, I uh, started worrying about Sandy. In sickness and in health, those aren't just words. That's what we live by. I called because I wanted to get information about advanced genomic testing. I felt like I was getting educated about the diagnostic tools that were used, the treatment options that were available, and it was a lot of options and tools that I hadn't heard about at other facilities that I had already contacted. We met with three different doctors, a radiologist, a surgeon, and an oncologist. Each one of them educated us on the technique that they would use and why it was an option for Ed. And then it was up to Ed to decide which option he wanted to go with. It was, it was something that I couldn't fix myself. You know, I, I had to depend on someone else to, to help me with this. It made me feel a lot better that we had a plan. The genomic testing changed the whole way we looked at his cancer. Instead of wasting time uh, on drugs or treatments that are unnecessary or that weaken your body, the genomic testing points the team in the right direction of this is what we need to try first. And because of that, it was able to be treated specifically to his mutation, which proved very effective. When I actually started the, the targeted therapy, I had three nodules in my left lung, and they were gone in 18 weeks. Yeah, amazing. I'm uh, 10 months disease-free, 10 months after uh, almost five years, but and I can't tell you how I am. <laughs> <laughs> we're trying to get on with our retirement. It's sort of been delayed, but we're happy that we're gonna have a retirement. So that's what we're doing. We're getting on with our life. <laughs>